All right, I think it's so important to dress modestly at the gym. Don't have your breasts or your ass hanging out and don't wear shorts because with the shorts, people can see inside. If you bend over or do leg raises, people can see inside of there. I see ladies at the gym doing that. Also, if you're doing any kind of mountain runners or leg works, keep your ass in your crotch to the wall, not out to the crowd. <laughs> I. I don't know if ladies do this on purpose or if they're just so unaware. I go to a gym that has very few people in it. The only men in there are the personal trainers. If I were to go to a gym that had many men, I would wear this. Okay, long shorts. Now I'm at the gym, so it's going to be tight. And this is athletic attire, which is nice because it's, um, if I get sweaty, it, it breathes, it dries quickly. So it is going to be a little sexy. If I want to, uh, this is what I would wear if I were going to like an LA fitness or something with a lot of guys, but I'm not. So I will put on what I actually did wear to the gym today. Okay. So this is what I wore to the gym today. These are a little shorter, you know, like that. I'm covered up. They are a little short. But today my mood was just like, I want to be in my body. And this is a little shorter than it should be. I usually like to keep, I usually wear tops that go up to here because I want to keep everything covered. And so I really like to dress modestly in public. The problem with the running shorts is that you can see in. It's not respectful to the men. Ladies, we do not have to go around showing our asses and our crotches to guys to turn them on. Um, I think it's disrespectful and it's kind of a manipulative power play like, ooh, I can turn you on. I know you want me, but you can't have me. I think it's mean and it's manipulative and it's very mean. And I think it comes from hating men. So if I like men, I want to be considerate of them. So I dress modestly and believe me, they still get turned on seeing me in this. Some guys even get turned on. You know, if I put my hair in a ponytail, some guys will get turned on just seeing a ponytail. That's all they need. They don't need that much. Okay, at the beach, the only place I think a woman should dress scantily in public is at the beach when her children aren't there. This is me personally. You can do what you want. I'm just sharing what I do. At the beach, I wear a skanky little slutty little bikini thong. I wear a little thong bikini like Brazilian thong bikini unless one of my kids or grandkids is with me then it's a modest one piece. I'm not going to shake, wear my ass out around my kids. It's inappropriate. Okay. So modesty or around my parents, or if I were dating a guy, his family, <laughs> but if I'm just going alone to the beach, then I'm like, well, fuck it. I'm supposed to be naked here practically. <laughs> but, um, on first dates, I wear business attire. I don't show anything. Guys don't need to see everything. They can get so turned on in a beautiful dress or business attire. At the end of this video, I'm going to post a few photos that I took for my other business where I'm wearing um, like a suit, a dress, and that's how I dress in public. That's how I would dress on a date. And unless it was a boyfriend, if it's a boyfriend, I would wear something a little bit more sexy but not for a first date and certainly not for going out by myself. So that's just my, how I feel about it. And I like to dress sexy by wearing form fitting clothes and being strong and being happy and being healthy. I think that's sexy. I think my hair is sexy. I think my strength is sexy. I think the way I walk is sexy. I think my clothing is sexy. I don't have to show my ass, my pussy, or my breasts to be sexy. I think that's skanky and trashy, frankly. Low grade. That's my opinion. Certainly you can disagree with me. But I will say this. When women dress skanky, it makes men think of them as sluts, as hoes, as down to fuck. And they don't even think about what the woman could be because they're just ogling her body and getting hard. And they think with their little dick. And the woman is sending signals not knowing that she's just a fuck object. And I don't like to be objectified. Men really treat me with a lot of respect. 
because of the way that I dress, I believe, and my standards. So, like, even for me, I haven't had intercourse without a condom in over four years. Women like me don't sleep around. Women like me don't hook up. Women like me don't invite stray men into our homes and bring men in and out of our lives. Like, I'm very intentional, and I think modesty, modesty is so important. Um, women who aren't modest and who throw their sexuality at men, you're just creating a lot of drama and bad men into their lives, in my opinion. Low quality men, low quality relationships, unhappy lives. So if women have trouble being modest, I think they have to think about why do I have to lead with my body? Don't I value other parts of myself? Don't men want other parts of myself? those parts maybe could be enlivened. So now at the, I'm going to finish this video and now I'm going to post a few photos that show how I like to dress.